Hello Capricorn and welcome back to my channel Luma Moon Tarot. So Capricorn, just checking into the energy for you in October, right? Um, seeing what's going on around you in love. This reading is for the collective, so just take what resonates, Cappy. Leave the rest behind, right? And thank you so much everyone for all of your support. I truly do mean that, you guys. Thank you so much. All the likes, the comments, you guys, everybody is so good to me out here. Um, and all of the subscribes, thank you, thank you, thank you for everything. All right, Spirit, what do you need uh, my Capricorns to know? Messages for Capricorn. <laughs> There's somebody out here who just quite simply, they just don't know what to do. Okay, they're like, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. That's what I keep hearing when I hear this cut when I felt this card came out. It's like, I don't know what to do. And the divine is like, dude, we've been telling you what to do. Make a decision. Choose a new path. Stop waiting around for the perfect opportunity. There's never going to be a perfect opportunity, um, really to change your life around. You just got to do it. You've got to turn around and confront this. You keep ignoring the situation. You keep uh, um, trying to, um, what's the word I'm looking for? They're ignoring it. They're trying, they're trying to keep their back turned. They don't want to deal with it. And the divine is like, it's time for you to, to look at this. Okay, avoiding, right? They're in avoidance energy. Yeah, choose a new path. Choose a new path. <laughs> I'm telling you, I cannot make it up, you guys. There's the two of wands here, okay? They have a decision to make. They've been waiting for their ships to come in. They've been waiting for um, an opportunity, but I'm kind of getting the sense that this ship in this picture is sailing away. They're about to lose the opportunity here to make some kind of life change. This could be your energy as well, not knowing what to do, not knowing where to go. And I feel like the divine is going to be showing you here. I feel like this is your person from your past, okay? I don't know what to do. Well, Spirit's been showing them the whole time what they need to do, okay? Yeah, love. Love is the answer here. Go towards what you love, okay? You have, I feel like the divine is telling this person, you have a chance, a blessing. This is an opportunity, though. If you don't do something about it or take action towards it or put in the effort, this blessing is going to go to someone else. Okay? And then you're really going to be stuck. That's what the divine is telling this person. Okay? This is too many cards, but this is, look, they're supposed to make something right with you, collective or Capricorn, sorry, <laughs> they're supposed to, they were supposed to make this right in this lifetime. This person's taken advantage of you. Uh, maybe in the most vulnerable time in your life, this person came in and took advantage of you and took from you. They, you know, you may not even have a lot. This is someone in poverty, in five of pentacles, having a financial struggle, feeling out in the cold. I feel like when you were at your most vulnerable point, this person came and took something from you. It could have been money. It could have been a material possession. It could be just your energy, your time, your love, your patience. They took advantage of you, collective. And now I feel like, and they could have attacked you, sent you spiritual attacks to an earth angel. Look at this. They betrayed you. They could have broken up other connections with you in the past. They are, they're supposed to be making something right. I feel like their life is completely off balance. If they were hoping for uh, opportunities or a new job or money to come rolling in, it's blocked. See this dolphin in the like right in front of this boat. It can't come. It can't come towards them. So, you know, I feel like this, this person is really being urged, feeling that pressure, right, um, to do the right thing, to bring you your justice. Some of you don't even want to talk to this person anymore. You're like, you know what? The divine has shown me everything I need to see. Um, yeah, I feel like you may not even want um, any communication from this person anymore after all that they've done. 
but I feel like they're getting their karma because they were messing with an earth angel the whole time, Capricorn. Okay, I feel like that's your energy. It, now they're sad. They're all up in their emotions, right? Like, oh, they're kind of feeling sorry for themselves. Like, what do I do, right? I don't know what to do. What do I do? Why won't my ships come in? Why can't I find a, a, the perfect opportunity? Well, it's because you need to make, they, this person needs to make some kind of decision, some kind of choice, a life change, okay? They need to choose a new path. You could be dealing with a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, maybe a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, possibly a Libra. Yeah, and I feel like you're in the process of moving on from this connection. You're looking at new options now, especially when it comes to love. I feel like um, you've got new opportunities coming to you, and you're taking them. You're taking action towards them, okay? Um, you're starting a new life here, closing out a cycle, starting a brand new one, being held in very high regard. You've got some high ranking here because the universe has seen all the effort you put into yourself, okay? They've watched you heal. They've watched what this person did to you, every little thing, every little bit of pain that you felt, the divine felt it with you. Every tear that you cried, spirit saw it because they're right there around you at all times. And now I feel like you've made it through this journey, through the pain, through the healing process, okay? And now um, all of these new things are coming to you. It doesn't have to be just people. It could be opportunities, jobs. Maybe um, uh, you could even be moving away, looking at where you're going, right? Uh, like I said, this could be your energy, not knowing where to go. And I feel like the divine will show you. But I am getting that this person is being warned. You need to choose a new path. You needed to make something right. You know, I feel like this person just, I mean, they've done pretty much everything to you that they can. To an earth angel, sent you spiritual attacks, bad energy. It's time for this person to make things right, Capricorn. Okay, whether this is your energy or your person's energy, take it how it resonates. Two of Cups, soulmate connection. But I feel like this person, this is their choice. Um, they're choosing between people and whatever person they choose is going to send them on a path in their, you know, in their future, like a destined, you know, destiny, okay, or fate. That's what this person has to choose from, either your destiny or your fate. You, it's one or the other, okay? So this person needs to choose. There can only be one cup. You know, and they, they've got two people here in this, pic, in this picture. They could have done all of this to you, Capricorn, and put you in some kind of competition. I don't think you competed with anyone. I think you're in this loving, gentle, caring, nurturing, peaceful, balanced, earth angel energy, okay? But the, look, the, the attacks never stopped. I feel like you're having a new beginning here. Okay. I feel like you're being blessed. A lot of options, um, high ranking, spiritual abilities, maybe a lot of money. Um, this is definitely a, a, a new opportunity here for you that you're taking. Yeah, you're leaving this person behind. Look at you, though. Look at you, Capricorn. <laughs> Oh my gosh, you're beautiful, okay? You are beautiful, and you're very successful, independent, um, abundant, okay? You've transformed your whole life. Um, you've reinvented yourself here. I feel like you're very focused and you're happy being single already. You know, with this card coming out, and um, I don't know. I just feel like you don't you may not want this person back. This card and the two of swords, you may like being single more than you want to be with this person who's been messing with your head. 
feel like they put you through way too much. You've healed. You're happy out here. This person knows it. It's given them a tower moment. They're like, what do I do? What do I do? Well, take some kind of action. That's what the divine is telling this person. Take some kind of action. We're not going to allow your ships to come in. Okay? You, you can't be feeling sorry for yourself. Because you didn't do anything, you ignored and avoided the situation. You've done too much to harm this earth angel. We're going to blow up your tower. That's what the divine says. We're going we're gonna to give you this tower moment and bring everything down for you. So you need to start over from scratch and rebuild. Okay, that's what spirit's telling this person. But, you know, either you make the choice or we make it for you. That is what spirit is saying. Okay? You make the decision or we make it for you. And if the divine makes their decision for them and intervenes, it's going to happen in a tower moment, something very sudden, something that isn't going to feel good. Okay? Like their whole life is about to get rocked, like for real. All right, so what can you show me? Yeah, and I saw the, the, ace, of, the ace of Wands on the bottom of the deck. Yeah, because you were their destiny. You were their soulmate connection, their twin flame. Their twin flame. Without you, they don't know what to do. Look at this. There's one dolphin in this picture, and their, their ships are blocked, right? Their opportunities are blocked. And here we have two dolphins in this picture and you both feel very free loving each other okay i feel like this person needs to make a decision in love they need to make it now and i feel like um they did too much to an earth angel i feel like they need to make that right and if this person doesn't take some kind of action the divine will they'll make the decision for them boom okay because they were messing with an earth angel the whole time. And they were supposed to take a stand and do the right thing. You know, you were this person's destiny, okay? And they, they betrayed you so bad. Yeah, look, I feel like spirit's coming after this person. I feel like a lot of people could be coming after this person for money. They may owe some money to people. Okay, or maybe they'll have to pay a lot of money or something like that, pay people off just to get out of a situation. They may know that. This could be what they're avoiding here with the Seven of Wands and the Six of Pentacles because they know they're going to have to confront people. People are going to be calling them names, right, insulting them, questioning them. Um, because if they take a stand at what they want, which I feel like it's you, um, they're going to get attacked, okay? But they were all right when people were sending you spiritual attacks. When they were coming at you with the Seven of Swords, Five of Swords energy. Yeah, look, they're, they know that there's going to be a fight. They're going to have to go through some kind of fight or battle to get out of a situation, and choose a different path. And they, they've been avoiding this. They don't, they don't want that to happen. They want the divine to present them with a perfect opportunity. All the divine is going to present this person with is a tower. It's going to be worse for them if they don't decide on their own. Okay? Because if the divine intervenes, there's going to be no mercy. Everything will crumble, and this person will have to rebuild. Okay, I feel like either way they're getting their karma. Either way they're going to have some kind of painful ending, some kind of difficulty, some kind of battle or fight. But I feel like with the Ten of Swords out here, this situation is pretty much over. Um, I feel like the only thing that um, they're waiting for now is complete and utter destruction of whatever they've got going on in their life, okay? And it's going to be abrupt. It's going to be very sudden. What is this? 
Yeah, I feel like, and this person could end up losing their stability as well. You know, this is um, also collaborating with other people, so they may still have other options besides you and someone else. They could have a third option. Um, Spirit's telling this person, clean up your mess. Clean up the mess you made, or we're going to do it for you, right? Yeah, you're moving on, collective. I feel like, um, Capricorn, you, maybe you were wishing for this person to come back around, and they haven't yet. I, I'm getting the sense that you're leaving the idea of getting back to get together with this person. You're leaving that idea behind. You feel very betrayed, okay? You do. You've been hurt so bad. They have done so much to you here with the five and the seven of pentacles is you know you were taken advantage of by this person okay and i feel like you're leaving them behind um keeping your moves hidden this could even be you moving to a new home so you could be making a location change maybe purchasing a new home for yourself give me just a couple more for capricorn but I'm telling you, this person's getting a lot of heavy pressure. It's getting to the point where um, they're kind of about to lose everything here. Yeah, they can't handle the pressure anymore. Okay, this is burdening them a lot because they know that it's you that they want. They know that you're their true soulmate connection. They know that this was a destined connection and they could have had the Ten of Pentacles, the Ten of Cups with you, wish fulfillment. But I, this person, they just keep avoiding the situation. They don't want to fight. They don't want to fight with these other people or whoever this is over here on their side. But they were just fine hurting you. Okay? They didn't give that much care. Betraying you the way that they did. So now the divine is like, you must pay. You got a karmic debt. We want you to make a decision. We want you to change your life. You're going to have to pay now. Oh, man. Anyway, Capricorn, that's what I've got for this reading. Just a quick check-in into October. I feel like you just need to keep moving on. Just focus on you. Focus on your abundance, anything in your future, right? Yeah, just keep your focus because um, it's, it's working for you. Just keep doing what you're doing, Cappy, okay? And I feel like you're about to get all of these opportunities here just laid before your feet and held in very high regard, okay? Anyway, Capricorn, that's what I've got for this reading I do hope this helps and resonates. Like and subscribe to the channel if you like this vibe. And until next time, Cappy, take care of you and peace out.